Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's California Collectibles here. I got a package in the mail. This one is from Cloud City Comics, and it was shipped by um, Jeff. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Let's see what we got inside. It's actually a larger purchase than I usually than I usually make. Okay, so. I'm not gonna struggle with it, I'm just gonna slide everything out. Okay, so it was wrapped with some tissue, and all the comics are in plastic bags. So probably some movement while it was shipped here, but everything's in bag and boards, I could feel. Hopefully, it didn't arrive damaged. There we go. There's our first comic book right there. We'll go ahead and slide this plastic bag off. So I ordered a whole bunch of random comics this time, but there was a blank in here that I really wanted and it was a great price. So first off we have Cloak and Dagger. This is the 25th anniversary um, portrait cover. I'm starting to collect these. This one is Amazing Spider-Man 46 or 487. This is the Frank Cho cover. You see there? It's really nice. Good condition too. And I got another X-Men Babies issue. This one is a deluxe issue. Pretty cool. I decided to pick up these darkness books. I think I got these for a dollar each, and they're like connect the covers. They make one big poster. Darkness number one. I got this secret invasion. It's a third printing variant, but it's it has a sketch cover by Lin um, by Lin L. U. I thought it was beautiful. Here's another darkness issue, number two. And Miss Marvel, Frank Cho. I purchased this because it was near mint. There is one small spine bin right there, but that's fine. I got this for a dollar, and the copy that I own has a whole bunch of spine bins. Let's see, I'll put this on the side. Always wanted to read this. Um, this is issue three of three. I think I got all three of them, but this is Death. Art by Chris Bacello. Uh, Here's another Darkness cover, number three. And this X-Men Alpha. I got this for a dollar also. I saw this at my comic book store for like ten bucks. I knew I could get it for a good price. Really, really wanted this cover. Um, this is the Adam Hughes cover. It reminds me of Laura Croft from Tomb Raider, but I don't think it is. It's the Heroes Comics, Heroes Initiative benefit book. Really beautiful cover. I like all the J. Scott Campbell covers too. There's this cover also, very shiny. Um, I got this cover for $4, but um, from this store, I purchased it for 99 cents also. Okay, this one... It's pretty good. It has some, like... It looks like vampire teeth marks right here. Like someone bit into the book or something. But this is an Adam Hughes cover. I believe I got it for a dollar. Beautiful. Here is another really shiny cover. It's all about the 90s gimmicks nowadays. This is um, X-Men Omega with Magneto and Omega, or uh, Apocalypse, sorry. Very shiny. It's in a really cool bag. Oh, there's some more stuff on the back. You guys can see that. 
and I don't know why I got this, but I got a Batman Detective Zero. Not sure why I picked that up. Here we go, we have Death One of Three. He got this cool Miss Marvel storyteller book. Um, I like the cover. They're in like pirate cosplay. And this one was a cool surprise. Um, Wolverine and Dupe. I've never heard of this book, but it looks awesome and I got it for a really cheap price. So I'm going to try to complete that series. I got some more shiny covers. Shiny Spider-Man cover. And Wolverine and Dupe number one. So I have number one and number two. I don't think I ordered number three. So I'm going to try to get number three. Um, these were a dollar, so I had to pick them up. Um, Ninja Turtles number three. Love the, um, love the art, love the cover. And... Um, I really wanted this. I saw a print on Dustin Wynn's table at Long Beach Comic Expo. And I just thought that I wanted the the, um, the cover art. Really beautiful. So I tracked down this book and I picked it up. Another discount Spider-Man book. Really nice cover. Some more Frank Cho art. I believe he did like three issues in a row. Here you go, here's one more. This is number 40, 489. The other one I showed you was 488. And another Ninja Turtle. I have number one, I bought number one when it came out, so now I have one, two, and three. Happy to get this for a dollar. My issues are all messed up, so uh, I got doubles in better condition and a J. Scott Campbell cover right here purchased it for a dollar really happy about that this is one of my favorite covers I really was hoping that it arrive near mint but there's like a spine bend right here you guys can see that there's a spine bend right here I'm gonna try to purchase this again in the future if I could get it in perfect condition, but here it is. This is Amazing Spider-Man 641. I like this story arc a lot. Um, it's like a, a love story with Spider-Man Mary Jane, and the cover is just beautifully done, very nicely, um, nice and artistic. And on the back, this is the reason why I made the big purchase in the first place. I got this comic blank, and it's like it looks like it's in near mint condition, if not very fine plus. Amazing Spider-Man. And these are going for a lot of money. These are going for like $15 to $20, even more. Um, I purchased this one for $4.99. And he hooked it up with some extra issues because he was... Um, the shipment didn't arrive on time or there was something um, going on with their shipment. But I didn't. it didn't matter to me because I, no, I was in no rush. But he hooked it up with a whole series of X-Men. Pretty cool. There's like... There's like four books in here. So that's really nice of him. So thank you a lot. Um, thank you so much, Jeff, right? Yeah. Thanks, Jeff. I really appreciate it. Um, shout outs to... I want to say it's... Yeah, Cloud City Comics. They always do a good job shipping my comics. Um, really satisfied. Thank you guys so much for watching. And let me know if you guys picked up any of these comics. Or you guys probably have these already. J. Scott Campbell covers and Frank Cho covers. But I'm playing catch up. A lot of really cool covers. A lot of shiny covers. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.